Hmm. Well, I guess this is as good of a night as any to go back out to the cove and fish. I wonder if that heavy thunderstorm and lightning last night did any damage to my lucky spot there. Hmm. Hey! Call me what the hell are you doing, you stupid son bitch! What's it look like, Gat? I'm going back out there and I'm going fish. After all that weather? Call you do realize if you keep heading out there every night, one of them nasty fish people gonna snatch your fat ass up. Oh, yeah, right. Go back home and sleep, you senile old coot. <laughs> what am I saying? It'll be the most action you've got in your whole life. No one will mourn you back here, you loner. Oh, that's enough of you, Gatsy. I'll go out there and fish as much as I damn well please. Plus, he's right. It's not like I've got anyone waiting for me back here. At least sitting by the water... Passes the time. Now, I got my pole, check, net, check, knife, and check, uh, box and bait, check and check, and dinner. <laughs> check. Seems like I'm all set. Guess I shouldn't keep the water waiting then. Not like anything else will change for me anyway. Looks like the fish aren't biting this evening. Wonder why that is. This cove is usually pretty good about fishing. Huh. Guess it's just gonna be one of those gloomy gray days. Just another one of those days. Again. Huh? What, what, what was that? It sounded like someone was crying. But that's strange. No one else should be out here this late. Everyone else in Capelin thinks this place is dangerous. Oh, Divines. Maybe they were right. I, I have to go help them. Oh. It sounded like it was coming from over here. Hey, where are you? Are, are you hurt? Do you need help? Come on, where are you? Yeah, it sounded like they're further down the cove. Oh. Hey, it's okay. I'm here to, I'm here to oh. help you. Oh, by the divine, you, you're one of. One of them? You're... a merfolk. I... I... I didn't... You... You look... Gah, blood. You're hurt. Your, your tail. It's pinned under a rock. Um... I, I think I can lift that. I have some bandages with me, uh... Here, let me... Uh, hey! Easy, easy. I'm not here to hurt you. See? I'm not armed. See my hands? I just want to help. You need it. Or else you're gonna... You're gonna bleed out here on these rocks. Is that what you want? 
I know you understand me. Look, you have no reason to trust me. But I'm the only option you have. Please, let me help you. Okay. I'm gonna move that rock. Here, uh... Bite down on this. <sighs> Ready? Three? Two? <sighs> there. Now, let me bind it up before you lose too much blood. You gotta stop squirming around or it won't work. There. I'm done. See? I'm not a bad guy. I only want to help. <sighs> wow. I've... I've never seen one of you up close before. I've heard of you, but... They make you sound all scary and mean in the stories. But you... You don't look like that at all. You're... One of the most beautiful creatures I've ever laid my eyes on. Uh, uh, I mean... You look nothing like the stories tell us. But... Oh, poor thing. You must have gotten caught under a rock slide in the, the storm last night. Wait. How long were you here? Pinned to the stone. Oh, Divines. You've lost a lot of blood. Then that bandage is only going to do so much. You... You won't last too long if I don't get you proper help. But I can't fix you here, though. Please. I have some supplies that I can help fix that tail of yours. I if you'll let me, I'll take you someplace where I can help you. Hopefully make you well again. Uh, I know you don't know me, and this is probably frightening for you to need a stranger's help, but... I can't just leave you like this. Not when you need it. Here. I'm gonna pick you up and put you in my arms. I have a cart down the shore. I'm gonna carry you there and then we can get you somewhere I can help you, okay? Here, just wrap your arms around my neck. And I'll just... <clears throat> There. You're gonna be alright. I've got you. Now, hold on to me tight. Let's get you somewhere safer. Huh. Here. I filled up a tub with some warm water. You can just uh, rest in it while I get everything you need. Yeah, there you are. Just relax. You don't have much strength left, so try to keep the little you do. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, 
This was quite an eventful day. Uh, I, I feel stupid now because you're in my home and you don't even know my name. I'm Colby. Uh, what do they call you? <laughs> That's a beautiful name. And then, I guess this means we've officially met. Even though you are in my house and currently in my bathtub. I guess you could say, uh, this was an eventful day of fishing, huh? <laughs> Too soon? Oh, sorry. I guess I act all awkward when I'm nervous. Well, yeah. I'm a little bit on edge. It's just that you're... You're not what I was expecting. I never thought that I'd meet one of your kind. And now that I have, I'm... I'm at a loss for words. Your tail, fins, scales, all with the image and likeness of a human, too. It's... it's beautiful. I guess the reason why I still helped you was because something that naturally beautiful deserves more than to be hurt and alone in a cave. Um, may, may I touch your scales? I, I just, it's so hard to believe that they can be that beautiful and real at the same time. Oh, wow. You are amazing. How could someone tell terrible stories about something so wonderful? Thank you for trusting me. You must know how most humans see half-bloods. And you still let me take you here. You're probably still scared and shaken from everything that's happened in the past few days, huh? Don't worry. I'm here to help you. And I'm gonna make sure that you're safe and cared for here. Now, whenever you're ready, or whenever you feel ready, I'll see what I can do for that tale of yours.